Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh The potential of orange peel waste in the production of orange peel powder Today, me and my members are going to present to you about our field study presentation for part 1 and proposal project presentation for part 2 PP slash FYP1 Our supervisor is Sir Muhammad Luqman bin Ahmad Sani My name is Muhammad Hakim bin Azman My matrix number is LG1902469 my name is Nurjana binti Muhammad Suko, LG1902481. My name is Siti Najihah binti Makye, metric number LG1902492. My name is Nurul Akila binti Jaafar, my metric number is LG1902489. We student of Diploma in Biochemical Engineering and Technology in Food. Assalamualaikum. My name is Mama Hakimi bin Azman. Ames. Our project aims is to produce orange peel powder that could provide health benefits to a consumer and society. Objective Our field study objective are first to identify the process of crude waste making powder, second to determine the type of method used in making powder, third to find the suitable solution to the food industry and environment's problem of Good ways, and lastly, to conduct a survey to public to gain more knowledge about the orange peel. All of these project aims and objectives was obtained with our panel from the public and literature review. The interview was conducted online via Zoom meeting apps. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Nurul Akila binti Jaafar. Now I will present company background. Company background from senior research officer. Official Food Science and Technology Research Center with Ibu Pejabat Maribi, Persiaran Maribi, UPM 43,400 Serdang, Selangor, Malaysia with uh, Tun Berlinda Mokta Okay my name is Siti Najiha Binti Makye. Okay, the reason why we choose to Rinda Mokta as our panel because Ibu Pejabat Madi Persiaran Madi UPM is related to the project that we will run. Okay, second, in the previous year, she and her fellow team are already performed and exactly the same project but with different type of road. Okay, third, this is their project title, Processing of Powder Bio Ingredient from Kony Waste. That's this she and her fellow friend were also more professional in the field during to their process in Mardi Sendian Barhat. Method and tools used during field study. Method that was used to, for collecting data of objective 1 and 2 is by interview session. The tool used for this objective is interview questionnaire. The resource was taken from our panel during the interview session, Membrilinda Mohta. The method and tools that has been used in order to achieve the third objective are by interview session, literature review as the method, and interview question and checklist of important terms related to our title as for tools. The resources was taken from our panel during the interview session, Membri Linda Mokta, and online literature review from website, online journal, online article, and e-books. The last objective was obtained from Google Forms as method and online questionnaires as tool. The resources were obtained by spreading the form to the public via social media. Hello, so my name is Nujana. Here we go. Findings data during interview. Okay, actually, on our field trip, we have an objective for that. Objective one is to identify the process of making fruit based powder. So, uh, the first process of making this fruit based powder is 
they will choose the best quality of greening and then they peel and forage the skin of greening after that thinly slice the skin to make sure it easy to dry next step is to dry the queenie peel then grind using dry blender to produce powder and the last step is package the product to longer the shelf life okay now let's move through the second objective which is to determine the type of method used in making powder okay actually during our interview to bring that told us to try the blender or using a wearing blender if you use a wearing blender we will get a better result because wearing blender can produce a finer powder the best method to drying the fruit peel is freeze drying method for a better final product proximate analysis method were used to determine the percentage of good fiber fat moisture and a few more at a temperature of 60 degrees Celsius is the best to try the peel powder. Let's move to the third objective to find a suitable solution to the food industries and the environment problem of fruit waste. There is no preservative were added during process of producing powder queening. They use the anti caking method and pre-treatment method in order to get a good quality of final product. Actually, fruit waste powder processing reduces an environmental problems. Thank you. Now we move to the finding data using Google Forms. Objective number four to conduct a survey to the public to gain more knowledge about the orange peel. An online survey question has been distributed in order to collect more findings from the public due to our pandemic condition nowadays. There are some of the questions that could be the best finding for this field study. Our first finding for this objective is the percentage of people who knows the benefit of orange peel are 33% out of 100 people who are answering our survey. Next, finding number 2, 89% of people out there who are consuming orange fruit throwing away the peel. This could be the factor of increasing food waste. Finding number 3. 75.6% from the public are aware about the, about the increasing pollution of fruit peel waste in this era of globalization, but still have 24.4% out, out of them are still do not know about this issue. Next, finding number 4. 69% out of the public are answering not sure to this question. This could lead them to waste more of more of the fruit waste due to lack of knowledge of the benefits in the orange peel. In suggestion, use freezer drying method to dry the orange peel of the better final product. Green or milk the dry orange peel by use orange blend the due to the best texture. Use freezer statement and anti caking method with no as uh, as prevention method in order to obtain a good quality product compare each dry method with a uh, present drying and over drying due to the texture the nutritional value and a few more Conclusion okay. First, there is a lot of information and knowledge that can be obtained based on first study by our panel and survey form. The explanation on how the process of making functional fruit powder was explained by our panel from the first step until the end of the product. By her explanation, we can clearly know how to conduct and use method for suitable processing. Okay, second. During the interview, the method for making functional fruit powder was successfully obtained. A dry blender, freezing drying, for cement analysis and a few other methods that could be performed at the college where used. Third, during the interview, a suitable solution to the food industry and the environment problem was obtained. This is due to our panel 
explanation of how she and her fellow team produce a functional fruit powder from fruit waste with no preservative added and use anti caking method for a better final product quality. It has also helped to reduce the environmental waste problem. Lastly, aside from that, a Google form has been established because of the topic of our proposal project, Orange Peel, we have collected a large amount of data from the general public. Approximately 89% of individuals toss away the orange peel, which is a waste to the environment and in conversion to society. Okay, project overview. We want to produce orange peel powder from orange peel waste. So, actually, for your information, orange has variety of nutrients as well as a number of health benefits. The wasting of orange peel happens because a lack of knowledge about the peel's advantage is a big serious problem that will happen towards human and the environment. Our source of uh, orange peel waste is uh, we taken from the consumer and the production of orange peel powder are developed with different drying method which is um, freeze drying method and also oven drying method. My name is Nurul Akila Binti Jaffa. I will present Pritas Chemical Constituent Screening Literature Review. Analysis of present of tannin is aluminium chloride coloring metric method, tannin acid as standard, UV visitable spectrophotometer. For panel, analysis of total of panel by Folin Regan method. Folin CO3 Regan measure of all solution by use UV spectrophotometer. So flavonoid flavonoid analysis of total of flavonoid by chlorometer chloromatic method measured by use UV spectrophotometer Proximate analysis literature review First, moisture content crude protein total ash and crude fiber content we analysis by using AOAC standard method Moisture content was determined by a oven method. Crude protein was determined by the Kelda method. Ash content was determined used by a Muffel furnace maintenance at 55 degrees Celsius for 5 hours. Crude fiber was obtained by digesting sample with H2SO and N A N no N A O H followed by incinerating in muffless furnace at fifty five degrees Celsius for four hours. Carbohydrate content was calculated of the difference of hundred percent moisture plus percent ash plus percent protein plus percent fat and plus five percent fiber orange peel with literature review nowadays people become more environmental constriction and try to recycle or reuse the waste they are degraded Mostly the tropical waste degraded of the kitchen 
at home uh, food and vegetable waste. The citrus foods are highest, highly consumed worldwide as fresh product, juice, and most often the pills is discarded as waste, which contains a waste variety of secondary component with chemical constituent that could provide benefit towards human health and recruiting of environmental issue. Problem statements. For social, most people are not aware of the benefits and throw away the orange pill due to lack of information of orange pill. Above statement were obtained by a survey forms with 89% of people throwing away the pill and 75.6% do not aware of the pill benefits. For economy, approximately 50 to 60% of the processed fruit mass is converted into pill waste which consists of the pill, seed and membrane residue during citrus processing, Wilkins et al. 2007. For environmental, dumping the pill waste or known as food waste at landfills contribute to environmental pollution due to release of methane gas, which known as greenhouse gas, resulting from decomposition process. SW Corp. 2021. Okay, signification of study uh, society to produce orange powder that is not harmful to our health. Okay, recycle orange peel as many consumer consume orange and can cause environmental pollution due to the disposal of orange peel waste. In fact, orange peel has many benefits that can be used because orange peel is rich in fiber, vitamin and polyphenol that fight the acids. They also contain limonene, a chemical that can, con that can protect against skin cancer. For environment, if not recycle, orange peel will cause environmental pollution because the waste will be dumped in landfill. Okay, as we know, landfill are the worst part because they are one of the largest source of greenhouse gas emission from the garbage sector. Therefore, it is important to reduce the orange peel. The skin peel of between 50 and 65% of the total weight of the fruit and remind them my product. If not, if not processed further, it will produce other soil pollution at as an insect protection area and can cause serious environmental pollution. For benefit, to identify that the skin of the orange contain a good amount of polyphenol that protect against several diseases. Okay. Peel orange have anti-cancerous properties due to the presence of limonene, a natural occurring chemical. Orange are one of the most consumer fruit among the family across the world. Orange is known for many health benefits and is one of the most popular all over the world. The refreshing tanginess of the fresh orange has innumerable health benefits. Therefore, the solution of making powder using orange peel can save the environment and can be used in daily life. So, what is our objective? So here, one, to analyze the phytochemical constituent of orange peel. Second, to producing orange peel powder by using freeze and oven dry method and also peel milling method. And the lastly is to analyze the orange peel powder nutrition composition by using proximate analysis. Okay, innovation aspect, a new idea and method for converting orange peel waste into a functional orange peel powder that could provide health benefit while also reducing environmental issue. Okay, as we know, orange peel waste is under retailer waste that come from orange fruit consumer. On the other hand, orange peel waste is very rich in sugar, polysaccharide, essential oil, and polyphenol. So there is a lot of literature focusing on the development and optimization of technology and process to some product from orange peel waste and that way we can make powder using orange peel. Okay. 
As a result, the goal of this research is to decrease orange peel waste while producing a high quality product. Now, let's move to the overview method. So basically, what we want to do is first, production of orange peel powder. Second, we will go to the phytochemical constituent analysis. We will talk about anything about phytochemical constituent analysis from the peel powder. And then lastly, if we will do a prosimic analysis. Here we meet again. So now let's move to the overview of workflow. Okay. Uh, this is related to our objective one, which is uh, to producing orange peel powder by using freeze and often dry method and also peel milling method. And the first step is preparation raw material, uh, which is like wash and uh, slice uh, the peel orange. And then uh, we start the process of production orange peel powder, which is... Uh, as we said, we will use a two different drying method, which is freeze drying method and over drying method, and then after that, uh, move to the milling method, and we will produce an orange peel powder. And then lastly, we will do an analysis for the peel powder. Now let's move to the next slide, which is co we'll cover the another two objectives, which is. Objective 2, to analyze the phytochemical constituent of orange peel. We will test whether there is a content of flavonoids, tannins, and also phenol on orange peel. And the objective 3 is to analyze the orange peel powder nutrition composition by using prosimate analysis. So, we will analyze and calculate the content of moisture, ash, crude fat, protein and also carbohydrate of the uh, orange peel powder. Lastly, we will talk about overview workflow is about preparation and production of orange peel powder. For first step, we choose rip orange and wash them clean for about 50 minutes and then we will peel and remove the skin from the flesh of the fruit as well as thin slices of skin. To make sure it is easy to try and then uh, we move to the next step which is dry the orange peels by using freeze dry method and also oven dry method and then we will move to milling method used for this process which is we will use a blender dry meal for the better powder form and the last video we will Pack the orange peel powder in a suitable packaging and store it at a room temperature for the next analysis. Prosimate analysis flow. Prosimate analysis to dry matter. It has dry at 105 darjah Celsius in 60 hours or 135 Darjah Celsius in 2 hours That's the moisture So dry method Divide 3 Kerja method Kerja fat and ash Kerja method Has Divide 7 Through protein and non-protein Digestion of acid With head and Catalyst NH4 Equal 2 SO4 Distillation with alkali 14 14% uh, 1.2 meter hash CI Titering and calculate uh, Recruit protein equal percent N by factor Recruit facts has divided 3 Extraction Bika with 3 Until 5 boiling Stoners will dry For 1 hour at 105 Darjah Celsius Add solvent Petroleum ether 
calculate L calculate all sample and record result as bending in funness 500 darjah Celsius in at 24 hours references these are some of our references that we use in order to collect more data and information for this slide now we move to the last one conclusion this project was developed with two different types of dry method in the production of orange peel powder phytochemical constituent analysis was involved in order to analyze the secondary composition in orange peel that could bring benefits towards human health and lastly proximate analysis is done to determine the nutritional composition of the orange peel powder thank you